What's up guys? Welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to explain to you and let you guys understand. Uh, I came across this letter, a small letter picture on the Facebook. So I pulled up the, the photo and this photo caught my attention and a lot of people asked me this question. I just did the brakes with you, meaning with me yesterday. And next day, my rotors are completely looking disgusting and rusted out. Okay, what's going on? Okay, I'm gonna explain to this guy. If you guys water looks something like this right here, if it looks something like this, don't worry about it, okay? Uh, water, moisture is gonna get on it, and next morning, bam, your rotor's gonna look rusted. So what you wanna do, I'm gonna tell you exactly what you wanna do. If you see this, this scenario happens on your truck, and uh, should be simple. Don't get scared, don't go bananas, don't get, um. Uh, upset with your mechanic. So I got myself a rotor here. If you pay attention to this rotor, we're gonna do a little bit of demonstration here, okay? We're gonna spray this rotor down and then uh, we're gonna take a look at it, okay? So you see this? This the silverish part is coated. If you get yourself a good rotor, they're coated and they're internally here, these vents are coated and the back end is coated, that would prevent rust in this area. You see this surface right here? You cannot coat this. This has got to be clean. You don't want to spray this with nothing. You don't want to clean it with anything. You simply want to leave it alone, okay? And before this video ends, I'm going to tell you guys what you should look into, uh, what you should do. Um, often, a lot of people let their car sit for a long time. Anyways, let's take these waters, and I'm going to place these waters on the floor tonight, and then we're going to look, look, look at it tomorrow. Okay, so we got ourselves our water right there, and here's another water. We're gonna take a look at these two waters, okay? So these two waters right here, what we're gonna do is, we're gonna take this uh, water, this is a simple, just water right here, and we're gonna spray this baby down, and then I'm gonna let it sit overnight. Okay, that's it, and then I'm gonna leave this one alone. I'm gonna spray this one, no, I'm not gonna spray this one. I'm gonna leave it alone and we're gonna come back and take a look at it tomorrow, okay? So, let this baby sit right there. So here we are, 12 hours later. This is what the disc looked like. Let's take a look. Look at this. It's rusted. Why did it get rusted? Because that water is gonna rust the water out. It's a simple thing. You don't wanna go too educational, too deep, but, um, in this case, as you can see, the area that has a surface, a coating, is not rusted. So that prevents a little bit of rust and makes your water look good. And this is coated, but it's an old water. So these are originally coated from, uh, from in the vents area and the hub area right there and internal. Um, anyways, what's the process here? How do you want to get rid of this? I'm going to go grab a, a brake pad, okay? It's a simple solution. Uh, so you really don't have to do anything, okay? Take your car out for a spin. When that disc spins crazy like that, and it's gonna just clean out your water, and that's all it's gonna do. It's gonna smack all that rust and corrosion off. A lot of people make this mistake, okay? A lot of people just let their uh, brakes, uh, the car sit for months and months, and when they come back to it, when they come back to it, it's all rusted and it's making noise. Where the brake pad sits at, it's gonna create a spot there and it's never gonna go away. You're gonna have that noise. Anyways, what you need to do here is get inside your vehicle, drive the crap out of your car, and try to drive it and leave. If people let the car sit for a whole week, give it a try at least once a week. Go around the block a few times and come back and let it sit and you're good. Okay, whenever it's hot and it's raining out there, Let's say you drove from here to the next town, got your grocery and came back and it was raining this the, it was raining at the moment. You park, you come back next day or hour later, you're gonna see a little bit of corrosion, okay? Within an hour, two hours, you're gonna start to see corrosion because that heat, when, once the, the, the water drops on it, it sizzles and it just, it just becomes rusted, okay? That's not a big deal, nothing to worry about. If you got yourself a brand new brakes and rotors and the next day you see this rust, it's okay. Try to run, it's gonna scrape it right off and you're good to go. Anyways, hopefully I answered your question and hopefully you guys are satisfied 
and I'm not worried about this little corrosion on the motor. Anyways, thank you for watching my video. Give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe, share, and like. And I will see you on the next one. I will try to give you guys all the tips and all the little bit of uh, uh, educational um, videos here and there. Anyways, bye-bye.